What it is, y'all, it's your old boy Pill, and I'm coming back today with more Damachi. Today we're going to be talking about the paid aspect of the current rerun banners. And there's a couple good reasons why I'm talking about this. Number one, <laughs> I'll go ahead and wrap myself out. I severely, and I mean severely, overestimated how well I did on those banners. So let me just go ahead and pull them up, and this is going to be a little bit of ratting myself out here. But let's grab Argo. Basically, everyone between Argo and Ryulu here. And so I've got most everybody. The only person I don't have this far is the new Orna, and I will actually be going after her because I do want her simply, if nothing else, for the collection purposes. But in this regard, I really like Elmina, and I could probably use a few more of Elmina. Um, I really do like the new Windfina and Thunderfina's really good, but here's the deal, okay? And I, I'm, I've been butchering her name for three years. Someone finally called me on it. Ariatni, I think, is her actual name. Whatever. Uh, so I could definitely use, like, one bond of her. So I'm one away with her, but I really want that Windfina. So here's the deal. Okay, here's the deal. If we actually go down here, there is a paid banner. Okay, let's just scroll all the way through here. This is a select gotcha banner. The long and the short of it is, all you gotta do is click on an adventure, go in here, and pick the adventure of your choice. In my case, Winfina, 100%, I need her, so we're gonna select her. Now I have Elmina here. I like Elmina. But she's only plus one. To be fair, she is an ailment unit. And ailment units don't necessarily need to be maxed. But I need two Yuris. I might as well. I should be smart and go after Yuri. Now, you get two adventures and an assist. Assist? That's a no-brainer. We need this, Ariadne. Or Ariadne, whatever, I'm, I'm still part of butchering your name. We only need one of her, so we're going to throw her on the banner. Now, over here it says we get seven attempts at this. Now, probably not going to go that deep. Obviously, that'd be a little bit insane. But we do have an, a, a, basically a guaranteed chance of getting one of these three units. Just one of these three units is guaranteed. So, it'll most likely be an adventure. But it could be her. So there's a one in three chance for either one of these. And there's actually a chance we can get more. So let's do one quick paid. This is 400 paid. It's a pretty re reasonable value. Now here's the one thing that you do want to be aware of before you go actually doing this. And I am aware of what I'm doing. But before you get too deep into this, you need to be aware that we do have other paid banners coming up soon. And each one of those paid banners is going to have a unit that's 2020 or newer on it. And that is going to be 250 paid iris per pull. So you may actually want to hold off and do those. But for me, I do want to max these units out. So I am going to go after them here and now. So I, what I'm really hoping for right now is that I'm actually able to pull a couple of Finas and a Yuri. That would be absolutely perfect. Super greedy, highly unlikely, but I'm going to live the dream. Let's go. That is not helping matters. That is certainly not helping matters. Let's... Oh, new force. Mm, 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 mm. Okay, so that's Yuri. 100%. No questions asked. Oh. So we got Yuri. We got Yuri. And we have one more coming at the end. So, hopefully... I, I, you know what? You know what? At this point, I wouldn't be mad if it was my assist. I would not be mad if it was my assist. Let's see what happens here. I, I would like Fina, though, but to be fair, my Fina's only level 60. The assist would be a better choice. I'm not going to be mad no matter how. Because if we get Yuri, he's max limit broken. If we get Fina, it fits my needs. If we get Ariadne, she's max limit broken. New phone, who dis? Okay. So, she is now max limit broken. So that ain't too bad. So if my 400 paid was actually super worth it in this regard. Now, 
that's just one way you can actually go paid and go into this banner. There is another way. But as I said, do be aware, we have another set of paid banners coming up here in the next day or so. And those are 250 for a more recent unit. That said, I'm still extremely happy with what I got there. 100% worthwhile. Now, let us talk about these paid bundles right up here. Okay. So we got a rerun bundle here. It's 800 paid. And what do you get in it? Let's take a look here. So you get a four star guaranteed ticket times one, a 2020 pickup ticket times one. Those are both 11 draws. Uh, no, I'm sorry. You get a 2020, 2020 pickup ticket times two. That's actually not a bad value right there. That ain't such a bad value. So if you really want to put the, uh, put the math to this, that is a uh, guaranteed ticket for the rerun two two tickets for a 2020 or newer. Remember, I said there's that uh, banner coming out that's actually going to have the 2020 and newer years, 2020 and newer units, newer units on there. Words are hard, uh, and that is going to be 250 per pull. So you're talking like basically that's the equivalent of 500 paid. The other 300 paid is that ticket, and then you basically have the three star ticket free. But there's also a prism bond on here. Now, initially when these dropped, I was extremely, like, I was very, very, very salty about the fact we were getting a prism bond, not a star bond. But I still kind of stand by that. Because if you're going to put a time-limited ticket on here, you already know these units are going to be really hard to come by. You know there's a lot of people who don't have these units that are going to want to max them out. Why would you put a, a prism bond? Remember, prism bonds are only for non time limited units so why would you put that on a banner with a time limited ticket give us a star bond that said it's not a bad value it's not a bad value at all you know like i said you're basically getting the price of two of those other tickets or two of those other summons that are coming in a couple of days 300 for the time limited and then a free prison bond and a free 11 draw it just it rubs me the wrong way to see this is a prism bond, not a star bond. There's a side A, there's also a side B that gives you an assist ticket, or I'm sorry, an assist prism bond, but still, it's just, it's a bit agitating to have a prism bond on something that's designed for time-limited units. It's probably nitpicking, considering we do have two tickets for the other one, but still, guys, I'm not a huge fan of these banners. They're not the worst value ever, especially considering what you get out of them, but I just would prefer to have a star bond. Maybe that's just me. Let me know your opinions in the comment section down below, and have you done any of the paid? If you have, let me know what you guys got, and for now, like, comment, and share. I'll be back with more Damaji for you guys really soon.